When she didn't call and didn't return calls or didn't text, we right away knew there was something wrong. Tonight, Wayne and Ingrid Phillips want justice for their daughter, Ginger. It's devastating. She's the oldest. The 41-year-old's remains identified by the Pierce County Medical Examiner after being discovered last week by workers at a construction site in South Hill. She'd been reported missing at the end of July, and detectives are now investigating her death as a homicide. We're grateful that the city decided to cut a road or the county decided to cut a road right there or we still wouldn't know where she is. On Sunday, July 29th, investigators say Ginger drove from her home in Olympia to visit friends in downtown Tacoma and then in Eatonville. That morning, she called her friend at Eatonville to say she had to stop and fix a flat tire. Another friend reportedly met her at the Chevron at 112th and Canyon Road and helped her change the tire. Investigators say the friend told them she drove away, headed southbound on Canyon, but Ginger never made it to Eatonville. At this point, we take a look at everybody. Everybody falls under the umbrella of being a suspect until we eliminate them. So we're not ruling anything in or ruling anything out. The last six weeks have been horrible. Wondering, 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 always wondering. On Monday, August 6th, investigators say Ginger's dark green 2000 Honda Civic was found abandoned in a warehouse complex on Valley Avenue Northwest in Puyallup, completely stripped and likely dumped off a trailer in the early morning hours of August 4th. Ginger's mom says her daughter struggled with addiction and sometimes hung with a bad crowd. She was loved. We loved her. No matter what her lifestyle was, you don't just stop loving your kids. She liked old things and to collect stuff. And so she would go to estate auctions and stuff like that. And if she saw something that was unique or unusual, she would buy it. While the Phillips wait for answers, they're taking stock in their own collection of memories. We're going to go and make the arrangements so that we can bring her home. And we'll know where she is then. We won't have to wonder anymore. And we're very, very grateful for that, that we are not that family that goes years wondering where is she. Jamie Tompkins, 